nocturnal, mysterious, and sometimes controversial. Bats have an ambiguous reputation, especially at times like these. But as with most things in the world, there's both good and bad. Here are 10 facts about bats that you probably never knew. Number 1. Almost 20% of all classified mammal species can fly because over 1,200 of the species are bats. Bats are the second largest species of mammal after rodents. There are almost 2,277 species of rodents accounting for a whopping 40% of all mammals. Number 2. It's a common misunderstanding that bats are blind. Megabats, also known as fruit bats, have well-developed eyesight, in fact, as good as humans, if not better. They have both day and night vision, as well as some level of color vision. Except for a few species, all megabats use sight and smell instead of echolocation for navigation and food search. The eyes of microbats are less developed, but they are completely functional. These bats have what's known as mesopic vision, which means they can detect low levels of light. Number 3. Bats, whales, and dolphins are believed to have evolved echolocation in the same way, but independently. Researchers found that a protein known as Preston and considered important in sensitive hearing mammals shows parallel amino acid replacements in the three, making it an extreme example of convergent evolution. Bats have additional structural features in their ears that help them sharply focus echolocation signals and estimate the target's position from the interference patterns of the echoes. Number 4. Bats address each other as individuals and often get into arguments. Researchers found that bats actually are one of the few species besides humans and dolphins to address each other as individuals. Instead of making generic communicative sounds, they use different versions of the sounds for different individuals. Researchers at Tel Aviv University were able to classify over 60% of the sounds into four categories. One of the types suggests that they were arguing about food and another about their sleeping places in the group. Number 5. The giant golden-crowned flying fox has a wingspan of 1.7 meters. Fruit bats are generally the largest of all bat species and can be identified from their dog-like faces. Among them, the giant golden-crowned flying fox is the largest species with a wingspan of up to 1.7 meters and weighing up to 1.6 kilograms, 4 pounds. The smallest species of bat and possibly the smallest extant mammal is the kitty's hog-nosed bat, which measures just 2.9 to 3.3 centimeters in length. Number 6. There is a species of white fluffy bats with a yellow nose and ears known as the Honduran white bats. Found in Central American forests, the Honduran white bats measure no more than 3 to 5 centimeters in length and weigh just 5 to 6 grams. They are well known for cutting the ribs of large leaves to create tents under which they roost during the day in groups. Number 7. Bat droppings were once a highly valued commodity. Known as guano, Bat droppings were used as an effective fertilizer by Andean people for over 1,500 to 5,000 years because of its high amounts of nitrogen, phosphate, and potassium. To a lesser extent, it was also a valuable ingredient in the production of gunpowder. Back in the mid-19th century, the guano market in Peru was so big that it was the country's largest source of revenue. With some of this money, the government was able to free more than 25,000 of its black slaves and abolish head tax on its indigenous people. Guano export to Europe has been implicated as a source of the virulent strain of potato blight that caused the Irish potato famine during this time. Number 8. Bats can consume up to 120% to double their body weight in food a day. Insectivorous bats consume insects like grasshoppers and moths that total to 120% of their body weight. This saves U.S. farmers an estimated $3.7 to $53 billion every year on pesticides. Frugivorous bats make excellent pollinators for many species of plants and also disperse fruit seeds. Some tropical plants depend solely on bats for pollination, like the agave, which is necessary for preparing tequila. Bats can also travel exceptional distances in search of food. The spotted bat, for example, can go as far as 38 kilometers or 24 miles. 
Number 9. The vampire bat's saliva has a protein named draculin, which acts as an anticoagulant and can be used to treat strokes. Named after Count Dracula, draculin keeps the victim's blood flowing instead of clotting while the bat drinks. For this reason, scientists are exploring it as a medication for stroke victims and for preventing heart attacks. So far, it has shown to be helpful in treating strokes and is effective for up to 9 hours. With further research, scientists hope to turn it into a practical and widely available medicine. Number 10. Though bats are very beneficial to humans, especially by assisting agriculture, they are also a natural reservoir for many pathogens like rabies. Being long-lived, mobile, and social creatures, bats can easily spread diseases. Unlike dogs, rabid bats do not show any signs of aggression. Instead, they fall to the ground, looking lethargic, but could bite in self-defense. If you are tempted to pick them up and help, don't. And especially warn your children who might not be aware of the danger. It is recommended to call professionals trained in rabies prevention protocol. If you have to remove the bat, carefully place a can or a box over the bat and slide a cardboard under it to trap it. That's it, everyone. What do you think? Did we miss any interesting facts about bats that you know about? Let us know down below in the comments. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video and would like to see more unbelievable facts, be sure to follow us.